I mean? It really did change my life. And that's kind of a powerful thing that has stuck with me. And that's why I'm trying to help people. And then get you signed up, bro. That sounds fair enough? Yeah. Amazing, bro. Chef Max here, you know what I'm saying? Morning, guys. Time's like 8 a.m. right now, and the plans we got for today, we got a sales call at 9 a.m. Talk to a potential client. We got to do our morning routine right now. What I usually do after I wake up, I meditate, make breakfast, drink some coffee, and then read it for like an hour. Let's do this, guys. 10 minutes a day is all it takes. So after I do meditate, eat my morning breakfast that I have every day. Literally, I've been eating this for like almost a year, like 250. But guys, basically, gonna make a black coffee and some porridge and oats. That's it, literally. With protein though, you know what I mean? I'm a gym lad, you know what I mean? So I need that protein. And guys, <coughs> sorry my voice does sound a bit cracky, it is the morning. You know what I mean? So, gonna get used to it, you're gonna get used to it. In terms of protein, I use two scoops for my oats, so it's around 60 grams of protein in a day. Just starting off like that, and around like 500 calories, you know what I mean? So, very good breakfast. This is why I eat it every day. Hello, it's Max Turner. You okay? Oh, good morning. Good morning, brother. I see you but to call early today, you know what I mean? Yeah. And how are you doing, bro? Is it right? I've asked you a few questions for like five, ten minutes. Yeah. Perfect, bro. So, the first thing I wanted to ask was, what motivated you to book a call today, bro? What do you say? Um, Amazing, bro. Amazing to hear. So, what would you say that you're struggling with as it relates to fat loss? Because that's what you, you was interested in, right? Fat loss. Yeah, the, the discipline of like, wanting to actually get into the gym and that because like the setback of uh, social anxiety, that kind of feeling that if I get into the gym, that uh, people are going to be staring at me. Okay, but let's think about this right now. Every single person that you see at the gym, whether they're skinny, fat, or hench, they all started off, bro. So not one of them is gonna think of you as, oh, this guy's out of shape. Bro, when I see someone at the gym and, I, and he's out of shape, bro, I look at him like, bro, you're doing the right thing right now. I look at them like I'm proud of them because they're actually in the gym. Does that make sense? If anything, I, I wanna help them, bro. I just wanna go over there and make them feel confident because I know that feeling, I know that exact feeling that you just talked about, bro. Like, when I went to the gym, I was scared to go to the weight area. So you see where everyone's lifting heavy weights and bench? I didn't even go there for like a month or two, bro. I was literally staying on the treadmill, doing machines, and did not touch that area. That's what we're gonna work on, bro. Like, when it comes to them things, like with PLB Fitness, we start off slow. So you're, you maybe think that you're going to the gym, you don't want to do exercises looking awkward and overwhelmed and stuff. You know, we take baby steps and we build that confidence, we build up that momentum, we start slimming down and then we start moving on to them other exercises. Yeah, so that's not a thing that we have to worry about. Yeah, so I can send it to you today, bro. The subscription is cancelable, so you can cancel if you want, if you feel like you don't want to continue with us. But eight weeks, two months is that period where you're like, okay, I'm actually seeing results now, bro. Okay, right, that's that's fine. So what I'll do is I'll make the coupon now and then get you signed up, bro. That sounds fair enough? Yeah. Amazing, bro.
So yeah guys, that's literally like how I make calls and stuff. Sales calls is a big thing right now with uh, the business I do. Yeah, we're trying to help people. We fill out a form, they tell us what really motivated them to actually book a call with us. We want to see if they are actually qualified for me to help. And we get on like a 45 minute call. Like, I, like this call that I just did there, we just break it down, see if they are working see if they are financially stable to sign up that's literally it guys like sales is a very big part of entrepreneurship or business it's like the main one of the main thing is do you know what's actually annoying me is that i actually have so many flyers and guys there's probably over 1000 flyers here i remember like trying to do this when i got them flyers i went to like around everyone's doors. I was feeling like, yeah, let's get rid of a thousand flyers. I thought it was gonna be easy. Start pushing them through people's doors. Guys, guys' letter boxes won't even push open. So when I'm pushing it through, it's just falling back out. Definitely need to get rid of these. I probably have like, there's not, probably have like 800 there. I got rid of probably 200 already. I might just go somewhere like Oxford, Stratford or somewhere, just stand and just deliver them out. We've got a grand though. So what I'm thinking now is, we didn't even read today. I didn't even read. I'll show you guys my books right now. How to Lead. It's a great book. Talks about like principles in a, in like a workplace, in like a corporate world. It's going to talk about like uh, the levels, how to just get ahead, literally how to like run a team, how to sell anything to anyone. This is a really good book. Talks a lot about social media and stuff. And this guy's uh, a, um, he is on, what's it called? Million, your next five news by Patrick Bet David, number one channel for entrepreneurship, value attainment. This guy is a goat. This book right here is an amazing book. I can't lie, amazing book. Prince, and this book is, is hard to read because it's written in like um, 16th century. It's, it's hard read. It's going to teach you like power and it's going to teach you how to run something with and keep something. So if you, yeah, look, look up this, this guy's. You'll teach you some things. And this thinking grow rich. I actually haven't even started this one yet. I need to get to that. What they don't teach you in Harvard Business School. It's a nice book. My brother's girlfriend actually got me this one. And Discover the Power of You. This personality. This is actually probably one of the first books that I read when it came to like getting on this self-improvement. A lot of these books, they teach you about like businesses in in a corporate world some of them and then also entrepreneurship but like it's the same type of skills that you need because entrepreneurship you're going to end up running your own like i just got in that sales call i could have people doing that for me in the office if it got to that stage where i'm doing loads and loads and loads and loads and loads and if there's people who are better than i am at doing it why would i not work with them Reading is very important guys, reading is very important, you want to read like 10 pages a day but guys we're going to head to the gym now, full body workout today, let's do it.
Yes guys, so the time is now 3 p.m. I was at the gym for a while, but I'm actually really proud. I did 100 kg today on bench. It's my first meal after that breakfast we had in the morning. Some chicken and rice. Yeah, I gotta make a schedule for a few people in POV Fitness so they know what time to go to the gym within their working hours. I gotta record a nutrition video. So I'm recording a new course because I found out that people are still struggling with what to eat. So I'm gonna make a whole new course to help them with that. One thing I was gonna say is, if you guys want me to vlog more, because it's basically a vlog, and I haven't vlogged in ages like that, so I kind of want to do it. It's actually fun. If you guys want more vlogs, I'm thinking to travel. I might like meet up with people in POV Fitness, because not everyone is in London. Let me know in the comments if you want that, guys. I wanted to say one thing. If you're feeling like overwhelmed with work and you've got so many things to do, because guys, I, I've been through this as well. Like one thing that you can do to not get overwhelmed and to not to burn out is just write everything. So get out your phone right now. I wrote like over 20 to 30 things. And then literally the ones at the top, just start ticking them off, ticking them off slowly. It's less stress. If you have everything in your head and you come in today and you're like, all right, cool, I'm gonna do this thing, I'm gonna do this thing. And then when you don't do it, it's gonna make you feel worse. You're gonna be like, oh man, I should have done that today. Guys, it's gonna make you feel horrible. Guys, get some quality sleep. You know what I mean? Rest up, take some time, just chill, man. Go gym. Yes, guys, so the time is now six. And what I gotta do right now, I gotta upload a short. So I'm gonna edit a short, get it out by seven. We'll do a bit of work on the computer, get some things done. Called a few PLB fitness members today. I didn't get on record though, but just going over the course, making sure everyone's on track. Yeah guys, in terms of business, people have watched me from before when I was a YouTuber, and now they see me making these type of videos, and it's quite a big change. I just wanna talk about it, like, I found a passion for working out and fitness from being like a very low point in my life. So I found I, I found it as a way, it helped me so much that I'm here right now trying to help others. I felt depressed, I had anxiety when I went out. I was taking drugs all the time, drinking every day, smoking cigarettes, playing video games. This is how every day is for me. The only other thing I'll be doing is just on YouTube, learning more things. Do you know what I mean? So the reading, working, going gym, literally recording stuff for my course, calling my clients, trying to make sure everyone's okay. That's how a day to day is. I don't even have time to like watch movies and stuff. When we're working, we're doing things like this every day, see where we go. Yeah, in, ter in terms of like fitness and stuff, I found a big passion for that because it helped me quit my addictions and it, it, it changed my life. You know what I mean? It really did change my life. And that's kind of a powerful thing that has stuck with me. And that's why I'm trying to help people just like how I did it. Yes, guys, the short's out now. You've probably seen it already. Make sure you follow me on the socials, Instagram, TikTok, all link in the description. Chef Max here, you know what I'm saying? We out here, we cooking today. Come on, come on. Guys, it's like 8 p.m. And remember I said I'm doing a nutrition course. I'm gonna record content for my course. So I'm gonna switch up. You guys are gonna see at the end what I make. Guys, it's gonna be a steak bowl. Very tasty, very tasty. I'm gonna enjoy eating it. Get some content for POB Fitness and let's get to work, man. Let's get to work. So yeah guys, this is it. May not look all that, but guys, this is extremely healthy. I'm gonna give it a taste test right now. So guys, I'm gonna give it a taste test right now. Let's get a bit of steak and a bit of squash. Banging, I'm gonna eat this all. So yeah guys, that's it. High in protein, very healthy dish. Thank you guys for watching A Day in the Life. If you want more videos, I'm thinking to go meet some of my students in POV Fitness, go travel, meet them up, train with them. If you guys want that, make sure you drop a comment, like the video. Some of them live in some nice areas, so I'm thinking traveling down there, getting an Airbnb, training with them, even collabs or anything, guys. You know what I mean? I like, 
I haven't vlogged in ages. This, this is like the first vlog I've done in like years. It feels good, man. So if you guys enjoyed it, I'll do more. Every day, really, just working, trying to improve POB fitness, trying to help, trying to get the best results for the people I work with as fast as possible. Trying to make it easy for them so they can push through their fitness journey. So guys, I guess I'll see you in the next video and take it easy.